Welcome everybody to Cave Story Plus on the PC. My name is HJ Tenchi and uh, let's start a game. Alright, so I originally started the game on hard because I like to always play the hardest difficulty on every game we ever play. And the only issue is to get the best ending because I ended up looking up what the difficulties do. Um, it can be really, really, really almost impossible to, for first timers to get the best ending on hard. Um, because at hard you never get max life increases. So I guess we'll try original because I don't ever replay games really. Um, and I would love to show you the best ending if we can get it. So here we go. Someone's transmission. Connecting the network. Logged on. Starting I am chat. Of course you're... Yeah. Sue? Are you there? It's me. It's Kazuma. I was somehow able to escape, but I got lost. I'm in a shelter without anything inside. If you're reading this, please answer. Please? Boop. And here we are. So we're playing on just the normal difficulty, so I really think uh, this should be pretty darn easy for us. But we'll uh, see how things work out. Right. It's funny, because uh, depending on the difficulty you choose, you get um, different hair color for your character. And what I've noticed, too, these don't show up in hard. So this game is going to be in infinitely easier, probably too easy now, um, because I was running around with only three health, so pretty much one or two hits and you die, um, but I also want to get through the super secret last dungeon, and I don't know if I'd be able to do that with only three health, so, I don't know, I, I know most of you don't care, but I I feel guilty on putting it on a, a, a normal difficulty. <laughs> so we found our first weapon, and we're going to go back to Cosma, who's searching for Sue. Once Sue was found in the network. Sue! Answer me! They're looking for you. Are, are you asleep or what? Your brother is so lonely. Lonely is a nice word of saying it. Well, thank you, gunsmith guy. We have a pew pew now. Yeah, buddy. And so far from what I've... Oh, God. He's got rocked right there. Uh, so far from what I've played... The only gripe that I have for the game is not that the difficulty is. Uh, I think the difficulty is actually a little easy on most of them, except for hard, which I think is just right. But um, the little Doritos that we pick up right there, yeah, that ding, ding, ding sound, when we start fighting a lot of enemies, <laughs> yeah, it, it, it starts to get a little annoying. <laughs> that's okay. It's, that's a minor gripe. Shoot these little things. Big bunnies. Kind of like, like if you had like a super deformed bunny pillow thing, that's what that would look like. The first time I jumped into this, it killed me. So we level up uh, our different weapons depending on what we use. Come on, Sue! Type something, will ya? Starving over here. I'm so hungry that that I even ate a cockroach. <laughs> Lol, just kidding. But just so you know, if I get to that point, I'll do it. Cosmo, you are weird, dude. Mega Village. Give me the key! No way! I'm trying to protect that Sue girl. She's an outsider. Sue's a good person. I won't betray Sue. Totoko, the next time that the doctor shows up, someone else will be taken away. If Sue isn't turned in, you could be in danger. But, but, just hand over the key. Oh, cheese it. Alright, you okay there, buddy? What? You're not an enemy. I thought you were one of them. My name is King. I'm the number one in the village. Though, I, I say number one, it doesn't really mean much. There are only six of us left in the village. Well, really, including Sue and Seven, but she's not one of us. She's just an outsider who came into our village. Okay. Someone's got to stick up his butt. The reservoir! Alright, well, let's go in here. Hey, buddy! What's up? Sue, yeah, Sue, that cute girl who's always hiding inside Arthur's house. She recently came to Amiga Village. She fell into the reservoir there. I don't think she's very fond of us. I think she hates everyone in the village. But she's a Mamiga, same as the rest of us. Only well, someone doesn't mind her. And we have a silver locket. Cool, it's a little fishy on it. Speaking of fish, there's a dead one. Sushi! I like him for a more. Oh, hey, what's up, little buddy? Wah! Also, let's look at our silver locket. 
Once over lock it in the shape of a fish. From the wear on it, this lock must have been dear to someone for many years. Okay. Oh! Hand over that key! No! Oh! King, you just got rocked. For being the number one, you are pretty pathetic. <laughs> Total cold. Don't underestimate me. Doesn't seem like she's underestimating you. You're just a chum. What do we have here? Shaq. You jerk! Whoa! Whoa! That's what I thought. Wah! Oh, help me! Help me! Uh... Oh, you're not the doctor. Oh, sorry about that. The doctor's such a cruel and evil person. He shows up in the village and kidnaps Mamiga. Times, killing someone. The doctor killed my older brother. Huh, a pendant. You picked it up for me? Sue gave it to me. But I don't want it anymore. The king gets bent out of shape when Sue and I get along. Please keep it. Nope. King? Whoa! It's a little toaster. I found you. It's no use hiding from me. I've got the nose of a clever harrier. Indeed. What? Yes, he has the nose and the brain of a dog. Misery. I found her first. You two, you're with the doctor. You must be Sue. The great doctor has summoned you. Come along with me. Huh? But, but I'm not Sue. Oh god, bubbles! Wah! Balrog, the rest is up to you. I'm the wrong person, I told you! Not this again. I always have to clean up. And I'm the one who found her, not Misery. So what's up? You want to fight with me with that little pea shooter? Yes, I do. Understood. Oh! Oh! Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, man. You're getting rocked, little toaster oven. Oh, you just got rocked, buddy. Well, remember this. Okay, I probably won't, because that was over in like 30 seconds. Ooh! More Doritos. Okay. I didn't do that. Let's see this guy upset. Huh? Toroko has been kidnapped. Ah, now the only girl in the entire village is Sue. Uh, well, thanks for being such a bleeding heart there, buddy. Obtain the treasure chest. Uh, obtain the map system. Cool. Something's written. So as long as you always maintain a sense of exploration, you will someday find a way out. This is my help. Okay. Oh, oh nice. I am using the controller, so this stuff is a little bit easier than the keyboard, I'm assuming. Assembly Hall, Arthur's house. There should be at least one more copy somewhere. Total she feigns ignorance. I wonder maybe Jack would know something. There's something on the other side. Oops. Oh, yeah, 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 we already heard that. I scarf on you guys. I'm guessing you're Jack. What did you say? Jodoko has been kidnapped? That's terrible. We have to inform King. Okay, let's go find out one here. Not Totoko 2. Totoko's older brother Arthur was our strongest warrior, but he was killed by the doctor himself. He wasn't even able to protect Totoko. There are two keys to Arthur's house. Totoko has one of them. The other is inside Mamiga Cemetery. So, can I help you? What What is that? That is a little guy, huh? Oh god, he's indestructible! God, it's like a frog version of a tonberry. Scary. Let's see any other little guys. Can we get up there? Probably not. I think much should die. Arthur's grave. Something is written on the headstone. Here rests the true Mamiga hero, Arthur. Oh, wow. And his key. Well, now that we've exhumed a grave and stolen uh, stuff from the true Mamiga hero, <laughs> a 
Let's cheese it. It's not anything. Alright, uh, Arthur's house, I'm assuming. Cost from elim elimination. Yep. Right here. Whoa. Flowers. Uh, my job is to protect this farm. To use Mamiga, or to us, Mamiga, these flowers are our precious source of food. But not the red flowers. We heard that if we eat red flowers, our blood pressure skyrockets and we'll die in an instant. Fortunately, on this farm, we don't grow those vile red flowers. This is a okay, that's really random. Hey, look. Oh man, this is so awesome. Yeah, on hard difficulty, you don't get any of these. And I love the Metroid cue right there, the Metroid sound. Our uh, music cue. Really cool. So, yeah, this game should be a breeze now with uh, these uh, hard containers. Nice. But hopefully, either way, it'll be entertaining. Hmm. What is this? Text displayed on screen. Cosmo, please. Just so you know, if I get to that point, I'll do it. Okay, so this is who's talking to him, possibly. A quarter now accessible via teleport. Down here. Flowers. Red flowers. The plot thickens. Well, the, why the flowers there? I, I understand what the plot thickens means. Alright, we're gonna teleport to the egg quarter. Whoa! Hey, elephant! Oh, hey, dead elephant. We got all kinds of crazy nonsense going on here. Hey, watch out for that little white thing moving back and forth down below. If it touches you, uh, you die. Just paraphrasing slightly, but okay. Let's go play with it. Oh wow, yeah, that's doing a lot more damage too. And from what I can tell, you can only upgrade it to level 3. I don't know. But see, now it's max. What does that mean? It seems like when you take damage, you actually also lose some of the Doritos that you gain. Whoa! So I don't know why. There you are, you monster! You don't scare me. Ah! What? You want some of this? Take your best shot. Even my big brother has never beaten me. Oh, shite. You just got rabbit punched. Hit. <laughs> you got me. Sorry, I'm sorry. Oof. Huh? Who are you? Oh, in the freaking back of the head. That's not cool. Dude, aren't you like one of them? Alright, well, rabbits just have like a lot of hate for each other. <laughs> Cthulhu's abode. Oh. Okay, first of all, let's save, because, oh, you're not an enemy, huh? Hey, this is highly unusual. You're a soldier from the surface, are you not? Where's your blonde pal? What? You lost your memory? Well, you better wander around until the batteries run out. I don't know what that means. Another health max. Man, there are a lot of these things. That, wow, it increased it by four. Have they all been doing that? Hmm. Either way, that's awesome. Oh, shite. Oh, I don't die in two hits anymore. Oh, I'm worried about it. Yeah, but so far from what I've played, this game seems pretty fun. And yes, those are whatever that is, it's an instructable. ID card. I guess part of the bonus is of playing through this area at least first. So speed it up just a little bit. Now, because what we do is... Oops. 
uh, we find out that these, the egg six and egg one, uh, have abnormalities. So you go and check out one, and it says you need a key card. So, check out six then, and, oh, surprise, surprise, there's a key card. And this is where you find it out. When you go to the computers down below, it'll show red. Ooh, whoa! Missile launcher? It's a powerful weapon, but it has limited ammo. Collect additional ammunition for falling enemies. You didn't get that in the freaking easy or hard uh, mode. Okay, so, yeah. Flying Dragon Egg number one. Egg status abnormal. Examine further. Whereas the rest say they're normal. Wow, that's awesome. I wonder if this uh, rocket launcher is like really, really powerful. Eight, eight uh, shots. Huh. Cool. There's a note here. Can't really get any closer to the observation room because of the shield. There should be a terminal that can remove the shield somewhere. And I apologize and feel guilty too for having played a little. Ooh. Yeah, just like uh, Metroid. But yeah, you don't get the missile launcher in the uh, hard difficulty either. Interesting. Um, I feel a little guilty for having already played a little of this. Oh, and those things can go through walls. That's cool. So there's. Yeah, so there. Oh, hey. Uh, there are some changes in uh, the hard difficulty. Cool. So for those that ever want to play, it seems like those are some of the main changes. Uh, no missile launcher, no health maxes, and I th think I've been told that the enemies have different moves on hard, like new moves. All right, so we used our ID card to remove that shield, but I don't, I don't know if that's true or not. Hey, Grah! Professor, very important test eggs, very important. Won't let anyone near them. I gotta use this launcher. Oh, shite, he just jumped over that. Uh, that's not a whole lot of damage. I can spam. Woo! Can spam my button faster. Oh, jeez. He's trying. What's he doing? What's he doing? Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Woo! Can you get up here? Yeah. Rocket! Oh, right in the face! Eat it, eat it! You're a little guy. Why are you being such a jerk? Defeated Igor. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, you don't want to say anything. Screw you, buddy. Egg number zero. Hey, you okay? Ugh. Ouch. Whoa there. I haven't lost yet. I'm going to take it serious now. Calm down there, buddy. Huh? Got knocked out by that monster. Did you save me? Yes, I did. This is none of your business. I can take care of myself. I hate this island and every little thing on it. Oh, this this must be it. Egg number zero. We can get off the island with this egg. I don't understand what you're saying. Egg condition is normal. Awesome. Uh, a password? Looks like I need a password to hatch this egg. If my big brother were here, he'd fix everything. Nothing to do here. Guess I'm out. Uh, uh, are you from this island? You don't seem like you are. The letters on your cap aren't from here. Maybe you're lost. Fine. I'll let you come with me. We can get off this island together. If you want. But in return, you're gonna have to help me. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Hatching preparations complete. Input password. Up, down, up, down, left, right, left, right. No? Fine. Safe. No more Cthulhu people in here. <laughs> Save. Now, ready? So cool. It's like a playing Metroid. This is bringing back. So many memories. <laughs> probably use the block launch more often. Oh, I think we can level it up, maybe. Can we? Let's see. 
Oh, we can. Awesome. 